And good evening, good evening, or is this good morning today? <laughs> I don't know what it is. I just want to say hello to all of you all over the world. How are you this day? As for me, I am fine. I am happy that now we're rolling, we're going into this whole As new year. Today here together. is the third, the third and um, the third day. What is the third? <laughs> Let's go up the top of uh, I just want to uh, welcome you and greet you and tell you thank you for tuning in to uh, House to House DI and uh, uh, listening to Isha. Okay? I uh, Like I always say, there is a, <clears throat> there's a button there where you, you can know if you, you know, just continue uh, listening to Isha. There's a, a like and share button that you can keep on pushing and pass the word, okay? Pass the uh, perceiving word of Yahuwah, the encouraging word that will encourage you and me. It has, it has encouraged me so much. You know, I got to thinking and, and just um, thinking, uh, how, how can I thank you that I really want to show and tell you about the, the, how great you are and thank you, my gratitude for what you have done for me, what you're doing and you're going to continue for the rest of this year and further on, Father. What you're going to do for all those all over the world that right now are calling unto you. You know, it says in the word that you hear their voice. You hear what they're saying. Ah, uh, so I think it's not strange, but all of a sudden you asked for something and you said, eh, he ain't going to answer me. The year's gone, he ain't going to answer me. Oh, really? He's going to answer you. Your answer is here already. Come on. You have to begin to let your ears hear him. Hear his voice when he's talking to you and be obedient and do one. You know, you might get up early in the morning, like right now, to you, wherever you are around the world, you might be asleep. It's maybe a morning, noon, night. Right now, for me, here in California, where I'm at, it's, it's uh, morning. Today is morning right now. And I'm so happy. I woke up cheering, happy. At the same time, crying because of the joy that he has given me. The joy that he has given me, that he says in his word in Psalm that he's given me a new song to celebrate with him. I want to celebrate with you this morning. I want to tell you, you be Baruch. You be happy. Be joyful. Put it, that new song in your, in your heart that you have that's been there. Take it out and sing it unto him. Oh, just thank him for the goodness that he has done for you. I know, I know we think a lot of times now we're going into a new year. What's going to happen? Well, let's not be there. Let's Get out of that. We've got to start, start thinking different and thanking him. Say those, that those things that weren't, now they are. <clears throat> those things that uh, we used to think about and we uh, put all our hope in it, they're here already for you. Be happy. Hallelujah. You know what that is? Praise him. Hallelujah. When you say hallelujah, I'm going to praise you, Yahuwah. I'm going to praise you because you are great. You are faithful and you are true. Hallelujah. Come on, everybody all around the world. If you're up right now and you're going to work, be happy. Look at yourself in the mirror or tell someone, in, someone next to you. Be happy. Be cheerful. Hallelujah. Pass the encouraging word, the Psalms, the scriptures that we're going to share today. Uh, Pass it on to someone else, okay? Come on, everybody. Let's start um, with, uh, well, tell you what. This is what I want to do. We're going to go to Psalms 145, and then we're going to go to Psalms 130, and we're going to expound and talk a little bit about it, okay? We're going to talk 138. And then, but you know, right now I want to, oh, and Psalms 139. Ah, it just came to me. Psalm 139. I didn't want to tell you, but it might, let's see what he wants, okay? Hallelujah. But let's go to Psalms 30, okay? Psalms 30, uh, <clears throat> I like that because he's always talking, uh, and I want Elder to read. And once again, this new year, I want you all to meet those that have tuned in, the new subscribers. Thank you for doing that. And I want you to all uh, meet 
Our unique people to me, this is Elder Josh. He is uh, the reader for me right now. And just wanted to let you know, right now you might say, hey, who's that lady with sunglasses? Oh, yeah? Well, right now, it's a little challenge. I'm almost through. Come on, come on. And we're going to hear him read uh, Psalm 30. I want him to read, uh, let's say, the three first verses. Okay. I'm going to talk a little bit on that. I want to talk, talk to you about it because this is one thing that I, I, I like to say and talk to him, to our uh, Yahuwah. You know why? Because he has, he's faithful and he's true. And I love that. I love to tell him how good he has been for me. Can you read it for us? Of course. Yeah. Come on, with joy. We, so, we read it, yes. It says in Psalms 30, I will extol you, O Yahuwah, for you have lifted me up and not let my foes rejoice over me. O Yahuwah, my God, I cried out to you and you healed me. Verse 3, O Yahuwah, you brought my soul up from the grave. You have kept me alive that I should not go down to the pit. Hallelujah. Do you know, in, in your time by yourself or you're driving wherever and, and you've gone or going through a time that you don't understand. The, why I say understand? Because, you know, when you're by yourself, it's the time when you, that's when you start to think. And you say, you know what, I don't know why I'm... I don't know what's happening. I don't know why I had that dream. I, I don't know why it says this and I don't understand it. This is a, no, it's a, new, it's a new day. It's a new day for you. He is the day that he has made for you. Remember, I want you to read the first three uh, verses of Psalm 30, and it, it's telling you there, if you ever, uh, uh, through this... Uh, 2021, you passed through a time where uh, you were sick, you were hurting, whatever. He took you out of that. Oh, my goodness. I know I went through sometimes, just like everyone around the world. You know, sometimes we had an ache, a pain, or whatever it was. But he's the one that took us out of it. He's yeah. the one that healed us. He's the one, if we were at that place where, wow, he didn't let us go down to the grave. Come on. You know? So now, because this is, you know, this is a whole new year. Lift up your hands, like I would say, and praise him and thank him. Hallelujah. Don't stay in the place where you think, oh, I'm going to go through the same thing. No, you're not. Lift up your head. Lift up your hands and thank him. All right? Amen. Oh, my goodness. He is so good. He's so good to all of us all over the world. Just want to say hello. Hallelujah. To Colorado. To Australia. To Florida. And Maryland. Hallelujah, yes, Maryland called, yeah, hallelujah, so many, so many subscribers, I want to welcome you, like I said in the beginning, greetings to all of you this year, but we're going to have um, Alter, let's go to um, Psalms 145. Psalms 145. Yeah. Perfect. Let's it says in Psalms 145, verse 1, I will extol you, my king, O Yahuwah. I will bless your name forever and ever. Hallelujah. Every day I will bless you, and I will praise your name forever and ever. Hallelujah. You know his name is Yahuwah, right? Come on, everyone. Every day forever and ever I am going to praise you. Hallelujah. Come on. Come on. Let's praise him. Yes, we do. We thank him so much. I am so thankful. Can you say that when you're by yourself? You don't want nobody to hear. He is thankful. He is thankful. Things that I don't understand, things that people say to me and I get offended or, or I shouldn't or, or you just <clears throat> cross your hands. No, 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 no. This is different this time, this year. Hallelujah. We're being in ascension right now. We're going up. We're getting wiser. We're getting brighter. We're, we're, we're getting to that place where you're face to face for with him. You know, I, I know you've heard uh, uh, the, uh, what is it, the Shabbat and the Terabites and the Triune, you know. Uh, am I saying that correct, Alder? Uh, triune with the, what do you Yes, call? correct. You're saying in tune with the in Triune. In tune with the Triune. <laughs> you got to listen to that. You got to listen because Alder Josh will take you through some steps. He'll take you through steps that you will understand that when we're being ascended, that we're going through it, we're going higher. 
And he'll take you through the time where there's, uh, let's say, steps. There's times that you don't understand. He'll take you through it. When you come to the beginning of the step, and really, it, it's called, we call uh, toda, toda. Toda is when you come and you have a willing heart to surrender everything, to say, you know what, here I am, Yakua. Teach me, lead me, guide me so that I can go higher Amen. to where? You want to go up? Come on. Come on, we want that. And he'll take you through. Just all you have to do is tune in, okay? <laughs> That's all, that's all we're going to do, everybody. But um, he's going to uh, go ahead. Uh, which, uh, did you read the scriptures? Yes, I can read the next uh, two. Next two in Psalms 145 says, Great is Yahuwah, and greatly to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. Hallelujah. One generation shall praise your works <coughs> to another and shall declare your mighty acts. Hallelujah. Let's declare his mighty acts to a generation, to our next generation. Hallelujah. we got all these uh, uh, young people that are coming up, and uh, we just can't let them slide. we got to tell them about Yahuwah. we got to tell them where we're going, that we're going up, that this isn't going to be another time where we're going to be uh, just being sad. No, no. Be happy. Put a smile on your face. And I, I will say, you know, it's good to tune in to, um, uh, let's say, the terabytes. And it all begins with the terabytes and uh, triune. And you know what? Thank you. And for let Isha speak. You know, Isha, uh, we've been on, uh, say, uh, encouraging women for about uh, maybe a year or two. But all you women and maybe those that are just tuning in, that Isha... We all know that is the word Isha is for woman. It's for the woman because Isha came out of Ish. Remember? But anyway, you gotta keep on tuning in, staying with me, and we'll expound on that more. But today, I just wanted to read um, uh, Elder to read Psalms one forty five, and then I want to go to Psalms one thirty. Psalms one thirty. Yeah. Hallelujah. It says in Psalms 130. All right. Now remember, oh. excuse me, uh, when, when Elder reads, he doesn't read the whole chapter. He, we leave it so that you can read it, okay? You go and search it out. But those four, um, five chapters, you read them. And then read the rest of the chapter, which is 145 and Psalms 138. It says in Psalms 130, uh, out of Eight. the, oh, 138, I'm so sorry. 138 says, I will praise you with my whole heart. Before the gods, I will sing praises to Hallelujah. you. I will worship toward your holy temple and praise your name for your loving kindness and your truth. For you have magnified your word above all your name. Hallelujah. Verse 3, in the day when I cried out, you answered me and made me bold with strength in my soul. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Make, made you bold. Yeah, made it made bold. you bold. It makes me bold this year. This year, I'm going to be bold. And I'm not going to be ashamed to praise your name in front of what? Anyone else? Because they're going to say, what, you're crazy? No, no. I'm going to praise his name. I'm going to praise him and thank him for his goodness, his loving kindness that he's been to me and to you all over the world. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're going to thank him, thank him, thank him that he's leading and he's guiding us. Hallelujah. He's been our provider. Hallelujah. We will not lack because he has been providing for us, for me and you. So I want you to read all that, all that verse, all those uh, verses in, in chapter 138. And I want you to also go to Psalms 139 real quick, okay? Because I want to just quickly expound a little bit on something that the Father gave me. But, you know, when uh, uh, maybe uh, we'll talk about it another time, okay? But I just want to read that so that you can get it in your heart and in your mind to remind you that he will not forget you. 
He will not forget you. He's not going to pass by you and say, ah, no. He said, I believe it's in Ezekiel, that I passed by you. And you know what I did? I spread my skirt over you and covered you. Covered you with my blood. His loving blood is upon you. But can you read that, that uh, verse right there where he says that I saw your substance? Aren't you out there all over the world? I want to tell you that, you know what? He's reminding you and telling you, I saw your substance. I've seen you. I know you. I'm the one that wrote everything about you in this book of mine. I wrote you from the beginning to the end. I know who you are. So I want to remind you today, everyone out there, raise your hands and thank him. Thank him for this new time, for this for this new year that's coming, that you are covered by him, that you right now are walking and talking and smiling and working, that you are moving in him. Right? Right. Hallelujah. Here's the verse. It says in Psalms 139, verse 16, Your eyes saw my substance being yet unformed, and in your book they were all written, Hallelujah. the days fashioned for me, when as yet there was none of them. <clears throat> yeah, okay, now that can be you. That can be you all over the world telling him, you know what, Yahuwah? I might be going through a sad time, I be, might be happy, I might, whatever you're going through right now that you don't understand and this, that, whatever. But you tell him, you saw me. You saw my substance when I was, what? When I was being made, when I was in my mother's womb, when I was coming out. Yes, you wrote it down on a page. You wrote it in the scroll. You wrote it about me and here I am because what you wrote you you are fulfilling hallelujah in my life and I thank you I thank you for this day father because this is a day that you have made and we're going to rejoice in you all right so I want to tell you all over the world it's so good it's ha I'm happy to say hello to you, say for those that are uh, barely getting up or maybe going to sleep, and hey, Jackie and Jeanette and all of you out there, hallelujah. Come on, Christian. Oh, I know you're feeling better now. Come on. Hallelujah. Praise Yahuwah. Uh, praise Yahuwah. So I'm going to be leaving you now because I know that I am going to go have a beautiful day with him just like you are today, okay? Just want to let you know, I'm very happy and I'm glad. Thank you for uh, for pushing the like and share button and always reminding you if you want. There's a comment little button. You can always subscribe to me. You can uh, send me a comment. Just to let you know that I've been thinking and praying about all of you. And uh want to tell you, sh have shalom. Remember, shalom is happiness, shalom is peace. It really has the power. It has the power to tell the authority that tells chaos, ah, ruiner, get her, start chaos. That's shalom. So remember, put a smile on your face, and don't forget, okay, to, if you want to, uh, subscribe. Push the like and share button. But until we see you again, um, please uh, read your scriptures, okay? When you read the scriptures, read all of them because, you know, we just read a little bit so you, you can continue on and enjoy the day with him. Okay? So, Aldo, can you uh, give us one last uh, scripture? Yes. So the final go. scripture is Psalms 145, okay. verse 5, which oh. says, I will meditate on the glorious splendor of your majesty and on your wondrous works. Hallelujah. That is good. So I say shalom to all of you until we see each other again soon. Okay? Put a smile on your face. Gotcha. Gotcha, Oregon. Bye.